let's look at my compensation as a W-2 company driver. First, we're going to talk about the logs for the week. I was paid for 2,484 dispatch miles. I had 3,133 logged miles. Log miles are not going to agree with dispatch miles due to carryover, which are runs that start in one pay week and into the next. Utilization percentage, which is based upon 61.25 hours in a seven-day week. My utilization was 101%. The day in orange was a paid 34-hour reset on the road. Now to look at my unedited pay statement for period 50 of 2023. This includes all trips from December 3rd to December 9th. The first trip started at the Fort Recovery, Ohio Terminal and ended at the Shenanahan, Illinois Drop Yard. It had stops in Oklahoma and it paid $1,241 for 1,661 miles. The second trip started at the Shenanahan, Illinois Drop Yard and ended at the Fort Recovery, Ohio Terminal. It had stops in Wisconsin and Indiana. It paid $547 for 770 miles. The third trip started at the Fort Recovery, Ohio Terminal and ended in Richmond, Indiana. It paid $30 for 54 miles. Empty miles paid $454. Securement paid $39. A 34-hour reset paid $100. Loaded miles paid $1,117. Stops paid $108. Total earnings for this week was $1,818. 50 weeks into the year, my gross income is $106,569, and I've driven 138,837 miles. This averages out to $2,132 per week and 2,777 miles per week. Estimating that over a year, I am on track to earn $110,832 for 144,390 miles. This week, I worked six days and took one day off on the road. In December, I've worked eight days and taken one day off on the road. Year to date, I've worked 257 days, I've been home for 61 days, and I've taken 25 days off while on the road. I'm not paid hourly, but let's calculate like an hourly job. For the week, my gross pay was $1,818 for 61.7 hours of work. If we break that down to the typical hourly job, it would be 40 regular hours and 21.7 hours of overtime, resulting in an effective pay rate of $25.06 per hour. Straight hourly pay would be $29.47 per hour. Year to date, I've earned $106,569 for 2,748 hours worked. Out of those hours, 1,991 would be regular time, 758 would be overtime. If we calculate it weekly with overtime, the effective pay rate is $34.08 per hour. However, as straight time, it's approximately $38.78 per hour. As always, make sure you're enjoying every day at work.